this. Week three. Tuesday. So day 22. But I'm just going to go from the weeks now. So just going to put week three. Um, got up this morning. Had my ready break. Had to come out. Quick. A few errands to run. Um, going to have my diet way when I get in. I've been online on Amazon and I've ordered the USN diet way, um, the one I like. Um, but I didn't get the strawberry one again. I've ordered the double chocolate because it sounds really nice. Double chocolate. Oh. So I've ordered the double chocolate one, which should be here tomorrow. Um, I've messaged Chris this morning. I'm just feeling a bit right, yucky. Yeah, I had um, a couple of biscuits seen last night, lost. some um, cookies. So I was feeling a bit sorry for myself. So I've woke up this morning. I'm still in a bit of a low mood. I'm just devastated that I only lost one pound. You know, I'm trying to think positive. It's better than putting on a pound. It's better than maintaining. I'm still down a pound because I really, really tried really hard and I've been so active um, to only lose a pound I expect it to be a bit more um, so I'll just have to deal with it and carry on, I'm not going to give up though um, woke up this morning all the bottom of my stomach through the dead bug One, two, ready? draw that belly button in Back is flat, yeah? So starting position, let them go down a little bit, stop about there. At the same time, put a little gap between here. There you go, belly button drawn in. And no round in the back, glutes to squeeze. Belly button's in. Don't bend that. Um, oh, my stomach is hurting. I forgot, after six kids, I forgot I had stomach muscles. Really, really, really sore. Um, aching but it's good I like it because I actually know well it's working it's doing something so it's good you know um, I like it my arms are a bit sore as well because of the the pull up I call it a fake pull up um, you know them bands I'm going to keep learning and learning and learning until them bands go and I can actually do a pull up even if it's just one I'll be happy so um, just on my way back home now going to have my dinner which is going to be the vanilla diet way again and then I'm not sure what we're having for tea but I'll check back in with you guys later it is absolutely lovely out there so yesterday we went out with the dogs I'm going to take the dogs out again today um, might take the kids as well might go around the park I'm not sure yet but we'll definitely take them out somewhere so um i'll catch back in with you later on hi guys right i'm just gonna add um i've just got back in from the park with these three lovely people um and the dogs we took the dogs as well um i was aiming for seven thousand steps today i've done six thousand four hundred up to now um I'm just going to add a clip in from yesterday that I did, that I didn't add yesterday because it was going to be a very long vlog. <laughs> I'm just going to add um, that in there. Just It's just me expressing how I was feeling after finding out I only lost a pound yesterday. Um, so it's just a few words I was having to myself. So this is coming up now. So I'm really disappointed. And I'm disappointed because I've really, really tried. I've done my gym with Chris. I've been slogging at home. It's not like I've been sat around on my ass doing nothing. I've actually been up and on my feet constantly. I've not been getting in bed till like three o'clock in the morning. It's absolutely ridiculous. I've not been sat there on my ass eating shit. Excuse my language. I'm very disappointed in myself. Um, oh, I'm trying to think positive because you know Chris said like we have been doing a lot of 
muscle work and that and at the beginning my my muscle well I didn't have none I didn't have no muscle so I suppose I'm probably building muscle at the same time as losing weight which obviously affects the scales when you're weighing yourself I have lost quite a lot of inches we did the inches three weeks ago um, so we're gonna aim to do we're weighing every week on a Monday and then every fortnight so every other Monday we're gonna do the inches now the only reason we've done it three weeks is because really it's only two weeks I've had in the gym with Chris um, because of the week when I had to go in hospital and I was ill even though I still then didn't eat crap I was still trying to stick to it I did have a McDonald's so I tell a lie I did eat an unhealthy meal it's not the end of the world I still actually lost 6.2 pound didn't I in that first two weeks oh it's roasting in here let me just put the sack on um, oh, no wonder it's on hot air so um, I'm trying not to beat myself up about it you know it's just going to give me a kick up the bum in it and say work harder but I'm just a bit disappointed. I'm a lot disappointed. Where am I? Who am I kidding? I'm, I'm a lot disappointed because I feel I really, really, really have worked hard. So I need to get these three hours in out the gym. I've got a bloody membership. I should just man up and just go in the gym on my own. <sighs> um, I don't know if to up my sessions with Chris. I don't know what to do. Like I say, it's only week three. I said after six weeks I'd review it. So, I mean, Chris is doing really well. He's doing everything he should. You know, it's just my body, probably. It's just the way it's going. Um, I did show you earlier on what one pound of fat looked like, and that's a quite quite a lot. So I'll use women out there, and they go, you know, I want to lose weight. I suppose when you look at one pound of fat, and you don't want only one pound out. That is a lot of fat. Like, I can't believe if if I've lost if that's one pound of fat, and I'm two hundred and what am I? Two hundred and twenty-two pound. Have I really got all that fat on my body? It's like gobsmacked, honestly. So, I am building a bit of muscle. So, if I'm building muscle, I'll be putting a pound on in muscle but then losing more percentage of fat. I think he worked it out and he told us like, I've lost, all in all, I've lost seven, what have I lost? 7.4 pound, seven and a half pound, 7.4 pound. Is that right, or 7.5 pound? That's in three weeks, I've lost 7.5 pound. Six pound of that is fat, is absolutely fat. So the other pound, pound point five, I ain't got a clue what that is. But I've lost inches as well. I don't know. I'm not the expert. This is where Chris comes in. But I have lost in three weeks six, six full pounds of fat, of fat, body fat. But all in all, in my weight, I've lost 7.5 pound. So I'm just going to have to carry on. I don't think, I'm not ready to up things because it's still early days and I'm still adapting. I don't want to up everything and go in at the deep end because I'll only fail. I know myself, if I jump in at the deep end and I find it really, really hard, I will fail, I will give in, I won't do it. So I think I'm doing really well at the moment myself. So I'm not gonna change anything even though I've only lost one pound. I've lost inches, I've lost one pound is it 1.2 pound this week so I've lost 1.2 pound this week I'm putting them points on there they probably don't matter but they do they do so they matter to me so 1.2 pound I'm just gonna it's better than a gain and it's better than staying the same I mean even staying the same isn't that bad but it's better than a gain it's better than one pound on so I'm just going to carry on how, how I am. Chris was just talking to me then when I asked. Now, I had to leave quickly. We didn't get as much in as we wanted to, but he's going to add a bit of time on in one of the weeks. I'm going to have to do something at home. Um, I, had to, I had to get the kids 
from school. So I'm sat here now waiting for George to come out of school. And the back now from the school holidays. So we didn't get as much, but he was saying to me then at the end that we're gonna start like food prepping. Because I'm not actually dieting. I am calorie counting, so I'm watching my calories and I'm watching what I eat, but I'm just taking healthier options. I might try a diet. Just Chris doesn't he's a nutritionist, he's a PT nutritionist. They don't believe in dieting, do they? But if I can diet and get to the weight that I want to get at, then I can maintain it. Then I can change my lifestyle and eat healthily and start maintaining. That is the way I see it. Chris didn't see it like that. He's saying, look, Sam, you've lost £7.5 in three weeks. We was aiming for £2 a week. Do the ratio, do the maths yourself, he said. So, thinking about it, we are above still £2 a week. Um... I'm probably gonna be crying later and devastated. I'm just trying to really, really think positive. Um, I'm gonna check back in with you guys. I'm gonna go in and get George. I'll check back in with you guys later. So guys, it's now bedtime. I've just come up, put the kids to bed. Um, you've seen what my reaction to my pound loss. Um, starting to get over it now, feeling a bit better. Just gonna work harder. Back in the gym with Chris tomorrow. Um, cardio day. So we'll smash that. Um, been out the last two days walking as well. So, hoping for better results on Monday. I'm not even gonna say what I want or anything I'm just gonna go with the flow you know what I'm living every day anyway I'm doing what I'm doing every day so if I'm losing one pound a week for the rest of my life there'll be now left of me will there but if I'm losing weight now for however long and it keeps going down this time next year I'll be happy won't I but you know I've sat there and thought about it and I have made myself a promise a promise to myself i am never ever ever going to let myself get this big ever again um because it is hard work losing it it is so easy to put on weight and before you know it it's like wow am i really this big so yeah i am going to work really really hard to get where i want to be oh what's to do papa say hi hi everyone oh where's your blanket where's your blanket hey Where's your blanket? Get your blanket. Get your blanket. Oh, that means she wants snuggles for bed, so I'm gonna have to leave it there. But I, like I said, yeah, I am never, ever, ever getting to this stage again where I have to work so hard. It's so easy to put on weight and life's just passing you by. You know, it's a lot harder to lose and psychologically, mentally, and everything else that comes along with it. So I am going to lose weight, get where I wanna get, and then I'm going to maintain that weight. I am not, I am not ever going to put myself through this again, because it is hard. And, you know, I need to give myself a bit of a break, I suppose. Um, I lost is better than no loss so you know i'm just being being daft out really so we're still on target for two pound a week so guys i will see you in the morning um and you will see chris also tomorrow because it's gym day night say night 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 just waiting there for cuddles with a blanket look 
Say night night. <laughs> oh. Yeah, night guys. See you in the morning.